these are jalapenos. Before I even touch them, I'm gonna tell you that if you want to, and I actually recommend and usually like to wear gloves. You can buy just regular like latex gloves at uh, any pharmacy and a lot of grocery stores and wear them while you're working with any kind of hot pepper to save your hands from getting the oils on them. I'm gonna run the risk today. Hopefully uh, I don't get too much oil on my hands. First thing I'm gonna do is remove the top of the jalapeno. Now I'm gonna cut down through the middle. And this is really the same protocol I would use with most any hot pepper. You can see it has this membrane and these seeds inside. That's really what causes a lot of the heat. So I actually want to remove a fair portion of that. So what I'm gonna do is take my knife and run it underneath and then along that membrane. And that pretty much gets rid of most all of it, all of the seeds in the membrane. A Couple of seeds still in there, that's not so bad. A Little bit of heat is good. Again, run along the outside and then come up. And of course, always be careful when the knife is facing towards you. Cut along. Now, if I was wearing gloves, I might also actually tear it out with my fingers, but not today. So I've gotten, I've had the membrane and most of the seeds removed. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place it cut side down. And I'm going to basically just cut small little pieces. And sometimes I might use the jalapeno in just strips like that, depending on what kind of dish I'm doing. But when I'm making salsa or things of that nature, I actually want it to be in a smaller dice. So then I gather them back up and I just cut down the length of those pieces. And if you want a smaller dice, you can always do that. But like with everything, I like things a little bit rougher, a little bit bigger on my slicing and my dicing. So that's it. And then I go ahead and finish the rest of the uh, jalapenos. So nice little dice jalapeno.